Hello guys, so today I'm here to show you a trick, but a way of improving your games, not crashing anymore. Most of you are going to be aware nowadays the games are very heavy and a lot of times when you play games like Microsoft Flight Simulator or any other games which are very heavy like similar simulator based or uh, you know like Grand Theft Auto 5 is not that heavy but, um, the likes of more like Call of Duty Modern Warfare if you're playing them and it requires a lot of memory and a lot of uh, virtual memory by I mean like RAM and you know it you have to do a lot of, a lot of read and write so sometimes it happens it crashes a, quite a lot especially with Microsoft Flight Simulator it crashes a lot so if you're facing the same problem which I used to have it a lot in the as well and I've read somewhere in the threads for Microsoft and how to change that so first of all you have to go is go to my computer go to system properties and then there is called advanced system settings as you can see that and when you open that you will get this tab in advance and it will says performance you can see this performance one click on settings and when you come to settings you have to go back again inside another tab called advance and there is a section called a tab called virtual memory so what you do is go change it and then it is automatically managed most of the time it's going to be set to zero i have not set uh, in my drive c any virtual memory because it's an ssd and because ssd has got a limited lifespan of read and write and i don't want to that to happen that's why i have set it to my normal hard drive in my other drives where i have space so when you click on them as my as I normally said normally you will have system manage which makes it most of the time very less so i prefer to have custom size it depends on the space you have available uh, in my system i have an availability of space uh, equivalent of uh, my ram is 32 gb so uh, the more the better so you have to match it up most probably to your ram if you have got 16 gb so don't go more than 16 gb keep it that range so as i i've my ram is already too much i don't need that much memory so i have set it to almost uh 8000 mb so like 8 gb 8 gb 16 gb i set it to half of my available memory almost so so as when you do that when you select the custom size and you enter the minimum initial size and the maximum press the set button so it will set it press ok ok might require restart ok that's fine apply press ok and that's all you need to do restart your system i'm not going to restart my one now and then you should see a very big improvement in your game place in one of those heavy games and load time like if somebody's playing shadow of the tomb reader yeah that play will improve and you might see some frame rate uh, increase as well maybe by one or two at most but that's it and when it, that's all guys so i hope you like my tip and trick for this one and i hope it helps you a lot with the crashing issues of application of game game applications mostly and take care guys have a good day until next time